Now, the famous flag waving. You've seen the videos. The flag looks like it's fluttering. People say, no wind on the moon, so it must be a studio. But NASA's response? There's a horizontal rod holding the flag up. When the astronauts twist it into the ground, the fabric moves and ripples. And with no air resistance, those ripples keep going. It's physics at play, not a hidden fan. What about the shadows? Critics point to weird long shadows and ask, isn't that studio lighting? NASA explains. On the moon, you've got sunlight reflecting off the ground, the astronauts' white suits, and the lunar module itself. All that bouncing light creates unusual shadows. If you actually measure the angles, they match what you'd expect outside, not under studio lights. Here's another classic. Why aren't there any stars in the photos? Simple answer, camera exposure. The astronauts needed to use fast shutter speeds because the moon's surface is so bright. That means the faint light of stars doesn't show up. If you've ever tried taking a photo of the night sky with your phone, you know how tricky that can be. One more. How did the astronauts survive the Van Allen radiation belts? NASA's engineers designed the Apollo spacecraft to zip through the belts quickly, minimizing exposure. The total radiation dose was actually pretty low, like having a couple of chest x-rays. Not exactly superpowers, but definitely survivable. 